Hey guys, Trevor here, and in this video, I'm gonna walk you through how to set up a VPN on your iPhone. It's pretty quick and easy, so let's jump right in. Now, there are a few different ways that you can set up a VPN on your iPhone. I'll walk you through some of the easiest ways to set it up and kind of how to configure them. Now, you might not know this, but your iPhone has a VPN built in if you have the latest iOS 15. To enable that VPN, you can head into settings here. Once you're in the settings, you can tap on your name at the very top here, and then you will want to tap on iCloud, where you can see it says iCloud right above medium purchases. Once we're there, you can see fourth down, it says private relay, and in parentheses it says beta. So let's go there. And what you'll see is that it says iCloud Private Relay keeps your internet activity private. And what this is, it's in beta form, so it's not fully released on the iPhone, but it works exactly you know, as you would expect for a VPN on your iPhone. So all you have to do is toggle this on. If it's off, you just toggle it on here. And what this does is it connects your iPhone to a server somewhere else and then connects to a website or an app so that it keeps your information private. So you can go to IP address location here and it gives you two different options. One is maintain general location and the other is use country and time zone. So maintain general location will give kind of a radius of where you're at, sort of the city that you're currently in. However, you can also choose use country and time zone if you just want to say, hey, I want to use the East Coast time zone of the United States. And it won't necessarily say exactly where you are in terms of in the East Coast, it'll just say where you are in the East Coast. Whereas if you say maintain general location and you're in New York City, it'll just show you generally in New York City to those websites and apps that you're connecting to. So this is one of my favorite VPNs because it's built into the iPhone. It works really, really well. Now, if you would prefer not to use that, there are a bunch of ways to be able to use VPNs on your iPhone. So let's just go into the app store here and we'll just download a random free VPN. So let's just type in VPN here. And I'll just choose this very first option, VPN Super Unlimited Proxy. So I've downloaded it. I can tap open here and agree. You don't have to pay for the paid version if you don't want to, so let's just exit out of that. Now, all you have to do once you're here, it might ask you to approve downloading a VPN profile. If it asks you that, just hit yes, it'll download a profile for that VPN on your phone. And then you just hit connect here. See this is where it says would like to add VPN configurations. I can just hit allow and enter my password in. And now it's gonna pop up with an ad because I don't have the paid for version, but I can hop out of here and let's go into our settings here. And you can see if I go back, now there's a little VPN icon right under personal hotspot. And that shows that the VPN is currently turned on. So I can go back to that VPN app and I can always, where is it? There it is. I can always turn it off. I can turn it on if I want to. I can disconnect from that VPN or I can reconnect to that VPN. So that's a really good way to configure and set up your VPN, both using the private relay on your iPhone itself but also a VPN app that's free on the App Store. Hope this helps. Let us know if you have any questions in the comments below and make sure to subscribe. Thanks.